Hello beautiful Libra friends, how are you today? We are looking at your energy, the energy of a person of interest to you. It doesn't have to be a romantic love interest, could be anybody, could be a friend, could be anyone. So let's see what we have here. We're going to cut the deck. Thank you for joining me. My name is Donna. This is Irish Donna Tarot. So let's see what we have here. The page of air spying on each other. All right. So Libra, what is your energy? You are very fiery, very passionate, very fun. You're in a very fiery mood. I've seen this in some other energy around Libra this week. Uh, messenger of air, six of air. You want a victory. You want a conquest, Libra. You want to conquer someone's heart. Look at this, a lover's card, Gemini energy. So you, you could be dealing with a fire sign or a Gemini or Virgo. A uh, page of water. Ooh, look at you. You are falling in love with someone that you feel is just the destiny brought to your door. You are definitely looking for victory in this relationship. Your person's energy is the messenger of earth. Well, they're much more grounded. They're going to make an offer. You're flirting though. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. The Hermit card, again, a strong Virgo energy. You're dealing with someone who's very spiritual, someone who is very much a problem solver, somebody who is likely to be highly sought after for their artisan skills, for their intellect. This is a person who doesn't need other people, very independent person. They're always seeking answers but very much a person who wants to connect with you with the messenger of earth they want to make an offer earth sign energy here we have the ace of air whatever this person tells you they speak the truth this is a person who very much wants to make a bold move and a bold offer to you to start something they don't want to be alone they feel oh here's emperor energy they are in it to win it let me tell you that that is air sign energy. Whoa, this is powerful reading for you, Libra. Your person very much will take the lead here. So I like this. You do get your victory. <laughs> Let's see what the outcome is timing wise. We have the page of earth. Okay, so again, your, per your person's very geared to, hey, let's get together. When do we get together? What's, what are we going to do? Let's go. Your person has a plan. Quote, unquote, a man with a plan. But that is your mutual energy. We have the Queen of Earth. Look at that. That is very much Capricorn energy. You may know this person through work. You may have met them through work. Your relationship is very much outside of work now. But you are very grounded. You're both nurturing each other. This energy is really, really nice because the Queen of Earth is a mommy card. So both of you have a very strong feminine ability to nurture one another. So it's a, there's, there is a sweetness and a groundedness that you can really trust in this relationship. There you are, Libra. You are the Libra queen. <laughs> that is your card. Both of you are very balanced in this relationship. Both of you are very clear cut that you know what you want in life. You know how to get what you want in life and you're not settling for less. The high priestess energy, you do have telepathic communication. That is a card of nurturing. It's a card of really putting each other on a pedestal. It's a card of mystery, intrigue. Something about your relationship is very mysterious to both of you. But when we get the lover's card with the high priestess card, it's a very, it's a very uh, loving gift from the universe for the two of you. So let's look and see what the wisdom of the oracle has for this relationship. This is a relationship that is going to grow very quickly, I feel, Libra. So I would advise, these are quickie readings or quickie updates, so I would advise that you check your moon rising and Venus. I find that my rising sign is powerful for me. Very powerful in terms of knowing what my future holds. Unfinished symphony. So there is something that's gone on. This relationship has lasted a while. This is not something that's brand new. We see serendipity, luck steps in. It looks as though you're going to have some time together that I don't think you usually have. The fates is reversed. Now, I don't normally use this as a reversal because the deck is not written with reversals. Colette Baird Reed does not uh, really encourage reversals. But the fates have stepped in, and yet you're taking fate into your own hands. 
Isn't that interesting? Let's see what the Sacred Destiny cards have for you at this time. What is the destiny of this relationship for our Libra friends? Libra, Libra. Okay. We have trust, trusting, trusting in this relationship. Good. It looks like there's a lot of trust. It looks like you're both so trustworthy and balanced that why wouldn't you trust courage? The courage to step into the future. Unfinished Symphony, there's a lot to happen here. And Serendipity says that you have some random good luck in this relationship, almost like the Wheel of Fortune. Libra, very intriguing uh, reading for you. I love the intrigue here. It's uh, not too mysterious. It's very, it's like a love story that's unfolding, and that's exactly what I see. Thank you so much for joining me. Sending you love from Chicago. I hope you come back and join me. I hope you subscribe. Thank you so much.